everyone, so I'm going to be doing a weekend vlog this weekend because I actually have some things planned for once and oh I've got a very excitable dog with me today. So basically um, I've just realised that I've probably started the past two or three of my vlogs sitting on my sofa with not very much makeup on telling you what I'm going to do so I apologise because it's probably not the best opening scene to have, it's probably a bit scary so sorry about that. Um, literally not long woke up, it's about 9am so not too early. Um, and yeah, it's Saturday today. So basically what my plans are today, I'm actually heading to London to go to London Fashion Week. Um, I've been asked to go backstage by Saint Tropez, the tanning people. Um, that's enough. Um, to the Henry Holland show. So I wasn't really intending to go to London Fashion Week because I'm not really like the most fashionable of people and I never really know how it works, like whether you have to apply for invites or whether people send you invites, like you just, I just didn't get it. So basically when I got that email I was like, it's not really an opportunity that I can turn down. Can you please be quiet? You're ruining my vlog. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to be going backstage at the Henry Holland show, which is super exciting. I'm not quite sure what to expect. I'm going to, I already feel like I'm kind of be in the way. Um, I mean, obviously I'm not in the way right now, but, but yeah, I'm sure it'll be an experience. And the Henry Holland show is always like, the House of Holland show is always one that I like look forward to. And there's always like loads of celebrities there, which is quite cool. Last year, Harry went to it, but obviously he's in LA with the um, tour. So that's kind of sad. But um, yeah, I just thought it'd be quite a fun day. I might be heading into London a little bit earlier to meet up with a couple of my friends, but I'm not sure what they're doing yet. So wait, I have to wait and see. Oh my God, such pain in the bum. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna walk um, this crazy mart to start with. Um, and then I'm probably gonna come back, get some breakfast, and then start getting ready. But I thought I'd bring you along with me. I'm not sure what I'm gonna get to vlog or whatnot. Oh my God, look at this dog. Yeah, I better take him on a walk before he goes absolutely crazy. So just take him out and how sexy my outfit is right now. How short are these jeans? I've not worn them in like six months and obviously I've had a bit of a growth spurt, which is weird. Considering I've not grown in like since I was 12. Nice little jumper with the hole in the arm. And then, yeah, I'm wearing sunglasses right now because I'm tired and I don't really care. Oh. So I forgot that Saturday they do like this big park run thing in the park. Um, obviously because it's called Park Run and there's like so many runners, there must be like hundreds of runners here so that's brilliant and they got to the last bit and it's like over there and there's some woman in a fluorescent jacket going come on you can do it and like clapping her hands like in this really weird rhythm and if I was a runner I think she would just really piss me off because I'd be like hey you're not running what do you know but yeah I'm not even running her clapping's annoying me so I feel sorry for poor people that are like actually running and tired and she's clapping them I know she's trying her best, but, you know. So I've just done my makeup and I've got my hair in rollers. I'm trying to get my hair, keep my hair in rollers for as long as possible so that my hair lasts for as long as possible. Um, but as I was doing my hair, I just remembered I had a really, really random dream last night. I dreamt that I got kidnapped, which is not good, and that I escaped, which is good. But when I escaped, the trauma of it all made me have an Australian accent, which is really weird. But I just remembered that when I was doing my hair and makeup, which is weird. So yeah, so literally just put on literally all the makeup in the world. I don't know what it is, but I'm literally just troweling it on at the moment, which um, isn't the best. But I thought I'd just let you know that obviously because I'm going backstage with Saint Tropez today, they very kindly sent me some products to try. Obviously, like, I'm not sponsored by them or anything like that, but, um, oh god, I think my, my boob was hanging out then. That's not good. I don't want to be flashing. Not that there's much to flash, but I don't really want to be showing that on the internet. Um, but basically, they sent me, like, they were so kind, they sent me loads of products, and I've put on the Self Tan Express, and this is the one hour tan, so you can kind of decide what shade you want. So one hour is light, two hours is medium, and three hours is dark. I left this on all night, so I literally look like I've been on holiday to the sun, but it's really cool, and it doesn't really smell that fake tanny. So, um, yeah, I've used that as my tan. Oh god, my arm aches already, I have to take my selfie stick today. But yeah, I'm literally, I've got like an hour, well, no, under an hour, till I have to leave. I'm going to head into London a little bit earlier because I'm going to go meet Meg from Meg's Boutique. I think I am, that's the plan at the moment. Um, I'm going to go meet up with her because we've got some time before shows and she's so sweet. So hopefully, fingers crossed everything will still go to plan and I'll be able to meet up with her. But yeah, I'm just going to finish doing my hair and then I kind of need to decide what to wear. In fact, I should probably do that right now instead of vlogging. Yeah, that might be helpful. my hair out of my rollers and I thought I'd just show you it because no doubt in probably about 10 minutes it's going to um, fall out. So, why is it that when you do your hair, like why can't it stay like this for the rest of the day? Like it's, they should invent 
an invention that makes your hair stay all day. So annoying. I'm just going to spray all this hairspray on it, like... So I've decided what to wear, and I'm going to wear this... Um, sorry about the mess, by the way, my blogging room is such a mess at the moment. Um, but I'm going to wear this skirt from Topshop, which is part of the Cara Delevingne collection. It's like furry, look at that. Can you see it? I'm like a walking animal. Um, but yeah, I'm going to wear this, and then this black high neck top, which I may live to regret, because apparently it's really warm in London, but wear a vest top and oh I don't know <laughs> and I just rang the taxi company and they were like yeah we think we should pick you up earlier than what you said because there's loads of traffic so I'm like shit um, but yeah I'm just gonna wear this I hope it's alright I don't know I'm going backstage so I don't know if everyone's gonna be like in jeans and I'm not like an idiot but oh, I'm literally just gonna wear flats these are from Topshop as well they're like a size I got a size up because everyone in the comments was like get a size up I don't know if they'll be too big but yeah this is what I'm wearing today Hopefully I look alright and not like Liz McDonald from Coronation Street. I'm going to just put my leather jacket over the top, probably not that I'm going to need it, but I'm going to go pack my bag and get ready because my taxi is going to be here in 20 minutes and then I'm going to head to the train station. Already hungry, so I didn't help. And then there was this really weird woman who 
who is a few hours in front of me. And no joke, from the time we left Waterloo to like when I just got off, she brushed her hair the whole time. She just constantly brushed her hair like genuinely worried for her scalp. And at one point, right, because obviously she could see me through this, you know, the gap in the seat. And you're staring. She, yeah. No, I wasn't staring. She was brushing her hair with such intent. Like, she, she was, and then she was like staring at me. So she was like really brushing her hair angrily and staring at me. And I didn't know what to do with myself. I was tempted to put my leather jacket over my face, but I didn't. Um, so we're just on our way home now. We're gonna make a pit stop at Maggie's because we're both hungry. And yeah, look at this tree. So cute. No fizzy drinks. Yeah, so what have they got? It'll be like squash and water and shit, won't it? Oh, like, can I you want a Yeah, can we get a medium Big Mac meal? What drink, sir? Uh, what have you got? Two seconds, sir. <laughs> Wonder if that's an old sign. <laughs> yeah, we have uh, bottles drink. So orange juice, water, fruit juice. Can you have a bottle of water, milk. please? We have any hot drink and frappes and moving. Do you want a frappe? No, I won't sleep. What do you want? Just a bottle of water. A uh, bottle of water. Yeah. Uh, can anyways. we have a uh, quarter pound of meal? Quarter pound of medium with cheese. I want a quarter pound of medium meal. Yes, please. And what drink? Um, an orange juice. Anything else? Mozzarella dippers. Uh, two mozzarella dippers. Yeah. And six nuggets. Six nuggets. Is that everything? Everything? Yeah, so cheers, pal. Thank you. Thank you. We're not going to eat all that. Yeah, I am. Are you, are you that hungry? Yep. When did you last eat? Like one o'clock. <gasps> I'd live it today. Ugh. <laughs> you carnivore. Hey, so I don't know what that was. Just me going, room. Okay, wait, I'll stop doing that. Um, I just thought I would end the vlog because it's about 20 to 12 and I'm about to go up to bed because I am shattered. Um, but yeah, I thought I would just end the vlog here because I don't think I'm going to be doing much tomorrow so not much point turning it into a weekend vlog. Ooh, hey! Um, Frankie! Stop it! Hope you enjoyed coming along to London with me and having a bit of a sneak peek of what it's like backstage at London Fashion Week. Definitely was a bit of an eye opener for me. It was quite manic and chaotic and kind of felt like I was just in the way. <laughs> um, but it was really cool to be asked and obviously the House of Holland is one of the most like biggest shows. That was really cool and obviously nice to catch up with like Meg as well. So yeah, um, but yeah, I'm going to head to bed now and I've got a reason for it because um, literally the biggest spider in the world was in our hallway earlier and Henry, as Henry was taking it outside, he put it in my face and I screamed so loudly that now my throat hurts. So that was really mean of him. But yeah, I'm going to head to bed now because as you can tell I'm waffling on which means I'm really tired. But yeah, thanks for coming along with me and I'll see you in my next video.